this is a good age for you. 60-year-old Walter Montgomery has a new artificial hip courtesy of UAB orthopedic surgeon Herrick Siegel. The procedure relieved his painful arthritis, and just weeks later, he's up and about. I feel wonderful. I haven't felt this good in weeks and months. Montgomery's rapid recovery is a rarity due to his fit lifestyle and commitment to rehab. But opening the door on the possibility of smoother replacement procedures for all is a new UAB technology. The basic goal of it is to create a scaffold so that we can regenerate damaged tissue. And the way we did it was to use this machine to make a scaffold that looks much like a cotton ball so that we can implant it into the body and that will and, and put cells on it that will grow tissue. The 3D cotton ball yeah, design is a first of its kind because it is both on the nanoscale and porous, which should encourage cells to penetrate the scaffold and generate more viable and natural tissue. It's very hard to mimic the characteristic of the nature. So the, our technology, we try to mimic the, some basic principle of the nature. With a few more adaptations, we can see something that can turn into real uh, medical implantations to uh, regenerate, uh, regenerate tissue and uh, develop real treatments. Treatments that can benefit joint replacement patients like Walter Montgomery, who welcomes the idea of a real hip bone generated in the lab using his own cells and UAB nano scaffolding technology.